this is a update again on well, what else? Medicine. A couple of videos ago I mentioned that I was taking Lexapro and I said screw it, it doesn't work, it's not doing anything for me and I've only taken it for two or three weeks <clears throat> and I just went ahead and stopped it. I ended up seeing the doctor or psychiatrist about a month and a half later and he pretty much ignored on the fact that it wasn't doing anything and he went ahead and gave me a four month uh, prescription for free which was like you know I don't know nearly seven hundred dollars worth of medicine um, private pay so it's horribly expensive uh, and he understood the fact that I couldn't afford it so he gave me the <laughs> all these this huge bundle of Lexapro I kid you not uh, I looked like a pill head when I was walking out of there but oh well he knew in due time I was going to go through a little problem a little personal issue in my life and uh, so he encouraged me to keep taking this medicine in the morning so I'm taking you know lorazepam and ritazapine at night to sleep which works perfect and here I am taking something else in the morning and I'm thinking my god another pill and I'll be damned if he wasn't right I mean in due time uh, within two months this medicine was in full effect in my system had no idea it was working didn't feel anything until my little showdown my little problem came up and and this medicine just went into full gear it really did and I guess it works I mean it just kind of gave me this I don't care you know attitude uh, everything is okay you know but uh, I've noticed people at work were you know have noticed me on this medicine and almost they would describe me as kind of bubbly and almost kind of fake you know like hey everybody let's go to work you know and they're all like oh my god what are you on <laughs> I need that but you know it just um, you know I keep saying you know so much to stop that anyway I've been taking 10 milligram in the morning and it's been about two and a half, three months that I've been taking this every day. And uh, it's getting me th through this little tough time. And hopefully when I see him again in July, he will wean me off, kind of, you know, cut me back on Lexapro and get off of it safely and not go crazy like I did on Paxil. So, yeah. That's my update on Lexapro. It has helped me through a little tough time, and you know this medicine's prescribed with people with GAD, you know, anxiety, all that kind of stuff, and it works if you take it every day, and you notice a difference about a good two three months into taking it. It's expensive if you pay for it privately. Hopefully you have insurance, but uh. I'll describe the effects of it when I do get off of it. Hopefully it's nothing bad or major. Uh, I don't know if any of you guys have any experience of coming off of it uh, when taking this medicine for a long time. I would like to hear something and hopefully it's nothing scary. Bye.